Hello everyone, I've got a grocery outlet haul. We went back down there because that turned out that Boston Market, I think it's called, what was it called? Country Fried Beef Steak, turned out to be really good. I had to add a little pepper to mine. I like pepper with mine, but I don't think they put any on theirs. But we wanted to see if they had any more, and then we found they had something else. So, of course, so it's not a huge haul, but it's some stuff we thought we'd was a good deal. I mean, we got some Sister Schubert dinner rolls. They had the huge bag with like 48 in them, but we didn't have room for it. But these were $1.49 for 10. Uh, they had these Hormel mashed sweet potatoes. Kitty, I told you there's not enough room. Not enough room. There, lay down. Okay, we'll do that. Let me move over a little. Okay, they had the Hormel mashed sweet potatoes for $1.49. It's a good deal. They're like $4 elsewhere. These are the country fried beef steak, the Boston Market. We got two more of those. You got to stock up while you can, you know. We've got this extra freezer back here. So, I mean, the way groceries are, yeah, you have to get... Uh, Get things when you can, as cheap as you can. That's going to fall and hit you, kitty. And look at these, y'all. Pillsbury stuffed waffles. It's got egg, sausage, and cheese in it. It's sweet maple flavor. Wow. I mean, take a picture. I meant to uh, take a picture of that. My shirt's... Anyway, I can't do it right because... Of... Hold on a minute. Okay, everything's piling up around me. But these are something new. And they're by Pillsbury, so I figure they might be good. I'm trying to get all the refrigerated and frozen first. There's a bag, kitty. And here's the other one they had in Boston Market. Um, they had a grilled chicken, but it was only for two. No. It was the, the macaroni and the meatballs with macaroni and cheese was only for two, so there wasn't enough in it for three people. And they had some kind of grilled chicken, but we didn't get that when we got two of these chicken parmesan family size. We wanted to make sure it was enough for a meal, you know. So we got two of those. And that's all this frozen and refrigerated, so I'll be right back. By the way, all these Boston Market ones were $3.99 each. Okay, got all that took care of. Um, saw a few other things. You always see something different down there when you go. And uh, this brand here, Margaret Holmes, if y'all have ever tried anything, has really good stuff. So when I saw they had these Simple Suppers chili fixings, and you just add meat, I thought it was worth a try. I like the red gold chili, uh, chili ready tomatoes. I use them about every time now because they have everything you need in them to start to... Uh, Unless you want to put more tomato sauce or something, you know. But that's what you use to, what I've been using to start my chili, and it's great. You don't have to put anything in it. So I'm wondering, this must be like that, since it says just add meat. So I thought it'd be worth to try the next time we have some uh, chili, which might not be for a while when it's warm. We don't eat as much chili, but $1.29 isn't too bad for it, really. It's a big can. Um... See, we got some Lance movie theater butter popcorn. I was trying to remember how much them did I tell y'all how much they let me see something. The stuffed waffles were $2.99. I forgot to mention that. And Joy got I don't know four or five of these uh, Venom energy drinks. They're only 89 cents down there. That's way cheaper than $1.49 for all of these. And I got one more of these uh, Flavor Mate Grillers Roasted Garlic and Herb Seasoning. This is just like Mrs. Dash. And it's only $1.19. Yeah. So I've been using that. Uh, and they're about to run out of them down there. Because once something's gone, usually you won't see it again. Down there. So I got two of the uh, popcorn. I can't really eat popcorn. I can eat a little teeny bit. But uh, this one's for Joy and one's for Logan. And Lance is a pretty good brand. Kitty thought these were treats. She 
she's been chewing on it a little bit but this stuff if you haven't ever tried it this Ritz seasoned coating mix this stuff is great on pork chops or chicken to bread with I always add a little bit more stuff to it but uh, this is the original they've got several I think they've got like a garlic an herb or something like that and they got another one I can't remember what it was but we've tried all of them and I just I like the original too uh, they're only a dollar let me tell you I know I looked at these a the dollar I looked at these same thing at Kroger and they were like three three fifty nine or three ninety eight or something crazy like that I couldn't believe because I remember showing joy I said look at these you I said these are the ones we've been getting down Every now and then they have them at grocery outlet. Not all the time. But a dollar is way cheaper than three something. And then we got one of these Betty Crocker fudge brownie uh, mix. Kitty, that's not treats either. She's, she's trying to. That's not a treat. Uh, for 79 cents. That's not bad at all. For that, we just cut the line. And then, you know, I'm stocking up on things when they're cheaper. Uh, you know, I bought two of these here. That, uh, this is Aldi's uh, brand, Reggiano. I bought two of the marinara, if you remember, for a dollar each. And these are the, there didn't have many of these left, the mushroom uh, pasta sauce. Uh, they were a dollar also. And I'm, I'm pretty sure now the, the ones at Aldi are $1.49. Uh, but I think they're still in a plastic bottle at Aldi, and these are glass, which, you know, I mean, I'm sure either one works fine, but it's it's interesting that they're glass when they've got plastic ones. Unless they're changing back to glass, I don't know. But they're not out of date or anything like that. can't remember. What was it on here? Maybe it is. I thought it had a date stamped on it somewhere. You know what? I don't know. I don't think there is one. You'd think it would be. Oh, here it is. August uh, 28, 2023. So see, it's got, you know, over a year. Hey. Yeah, it's got over a year on it. So that's good. So anyway, yeah, we stocked up on some things. And uh, that's what you got to do. So. No, go ahead. So, everybody, I hope you enjoyed this grocery outlet haul and visit with Kitty. She's being good now. So, I can't help it. Things look like treats to me. So, anyway, uh, if you did, I hope you'll press the like button. Also, subscribe if you haven't already and share this out. Sorry, I'm moving that around so much. It got pushed by something over here. I laid those brownies on it. Uh, subscribe if you haven't already and share this out and hit that so you get all my videos as soon as they come out she wakes up when I press the thing she wasn't asleep she was just kind of like that and when I rang the bell she was like attention all right everybody I hope you have a great day and I'll see you later on God bless